allow him to do what. Give goes to Johnson. But no, Johnson is stopped up for a loss. He lost with two in the backfield. It's Cole Brevard. He can check to whatever he likes once he gets to the line of scrimmage. We'll explain. On a third three, he likes the pitch to the outside. Trying to gain that edge and unable to. Dylan Thieneman. The confidence is similar. Let's see what this Nebraska offense can do. Fake it to Dowdell. Lyle tripped up and down he goes. Good job by Winston Bergman right here. Again, once he saw his opening triggered, found some space to get Dylan Riola down. Again, when you're dealing with a quarterback like Riola, he's always looking to stay a passer, always looking to put the ball. 32 this time from 44 yards away. And a Foles kick is blocked. Purdue got a hand on it, and Purdue scoops it up. It's Nyland Green, and this crowd is loving it. See the sideline warning on both sidelines on the same play. <laughs> Big time turning point in this game. Purdue Boilermakers, man. They're taking the message by Ryan Walters, their head coach, this week, and saying this is the week, this is the game our playmakers have to show up. This is the week we have to show the Big Ten. We're here to play. Everybody's open. Every part of the field is locked. If Holt can get this kick in there, he has another one block. And Purdue scoops it up. So a couple of times now, the Boilermakers rising, getting a hand on the football. This was everything as you're going to see the snap right there. Just that little bit of hesitation as the ball is spinning and it comes out low. You see Hall right there with another kick affected. The Purdue hoping that this, these guys can get into the zone. Third goal, trying to go up and over the pile. It's Ives trying to extend the football, but Purdue defensively right in front of the student section.